After fabric has been installed, the next step is to cut holes in the fabric to fit the hose end. Most installers find an X cut works best. Usually one hole is enough in the cavity. In a normal size sidewall and ceiling application, insert the hose downward approximately two to three feet. Fill the bottom of the cavity and keep the hose moving in order to fill the space completely and evenly. Then turn the hose and fill the area above. Continuously move the hose back and forth until the cavity is completely filled. It's easy to add sound control to an interior wall. Simply use fabric on both sides and blow. Be sure to insulate behind electrical boxes and around obstacles, such as pipes, boxes, and ducts. Pay special attention to corners, making sure they are completely filled. Before cleanup, use a very soft bristle push broom or length of hose to smooth your surface. Go floor to ceiling and press gently against the fabric. If you notice any spots that are not completely filled, reinsert your hose and add insulation using a low blow speed. If you overfill, remove the excess material so the drywallers will have a nearly level surface. As you gain experience, you'll learn the feel of a correctly filled cavity, and you'll be able to judge your work by firmness of the insulation. A good installer will periodically complete a density check following industry guidelines, and then document their results. Finally, pick up and sweep up. Gather bags and excess insulation, especially if it's on finished areas.